CBS 46 News at 9 on Peachtree TV. Getting results. To help slow the spread, we need to mandate masks. Breaking news at 9 o'clock. Masks are mandated in the city of Atlanta. Thanks for joining us at 9. I'm Sean Gables. And I'm Rick Fulbaum. Mayor Keisha Lance Bottoms issuing that executive order just moments ago. And Atlanta is now at least the fifth Georgia city with a mask requirement. The others, Athens, Savannah, East Point, and Doraville. This comes as Georgia reports another 3,400 new cases of COVID-19 in the past 24 hours. The state now has nearly 104,000 confirmed cases and more than 2,900 deaths. CBS 46's Ashley Thompson joins us live outside of City Hall. And Ashley, you have been speaking with those in the mayor's office today about this mask mandate. I have Sean and you know the mayor really believed that now was the time to implement this here in Fulton County, of course, where the city of Atlanta is located more than 9300 COVID-19 cases and the number is only increasing with each day. Wearing a mask in the city of Atlanta will soon no longer just be encouraged. Mayor Keisha Lance Bottom says she'll sign an executive order mandating that everyone wear them. All of the experts that I'm hear hearing from are saying that to help slow the spread, we need to mandate masks, and that's what we're going to do in Atlanta, and hopefully it will help some. Rob Bennett is the manager at Cafe Intermezzo in Midtown. They've taken steps to keep people safe at the restaurant, and he believes this mandate could only help. When the guests are sitting at the table, they can take their mask off, but if they go to the restroom or walk up to our pastry cases, they would need to put them back on. The CDC says cloth face coverings are most likely to reduce the spread of COVID-19 when they are widely used by people in public settings. Most people we spoke with support the mandate, though some admit it's a little frustrating. I have my mask in my pocket right here, so, but I don't wear it all the time because, I mean, I'm 22. I don't think it's cool to wear a mask. <laughs> there are, you know, definitely people I see walking around the streets that are wearing it, but I don't think nearly enough. Um, there's still a lot of people who aren't wearing them. So maybe a mandate is something that, that needs to happen. The mandate comes just days after Mayor Bottoms tested positive for COVID-19 herself. She took to social media to say she finally got her test results back after eight days and went on to say perhaps the National Guard can help with testing too. A small jab at Governor Brian Kemp, who called in the National Guard after recent violence in the city as coronavirus cases continue to spike in the state. Now, this order just came down minutes ago. We're still looking through it and reading it. I've learned that this mandate is for the entire city of Atlanta and Hartsville Jackson Atlanta International Airport. And there's no excuse, really, because the city of Atlanta says it plans to provide face coverings to the general public if they can't get one. We'll have much more on this mandate coming up at 11. For now, I am live in Atlanta. Ashley Thompson, CBS 46 News.